Abby Lee Miller claims she was abused in prison, they tried to rip my eyelashes off. In her first interview since being released from prison, Abby Lee Miller claims that she was abused while she served time for bankruptcy fraud. Abby Lee Miller, 52, is making some shocking claims about her time behind bars. The Dance Mom star, who served eight months in prison for bankruptcy fraud, alleges that she was the target of abuse while she paid her debt to society. Abby took to Instagram on February 18 to share her claims by posting a screen grab of an interview that she gave to Inside Edition. The interview, her first since she was released from Victorville Federal Correctional Institution in California in March 2018, actually aired on TV on February 6 but she decided to draw attention to it on President's Day. During the interview Abby went into detail about what she says she suffered away from the public eye. I have already been through the ringer, she told Inside Edition, adding, the first day was the worst day for me. Abby went into more detail, saying, they tried to rip my eyelashes off that were extensions. Abby also claimed that she was unfairly punished and put into solitary confinement after she was accused of sharing a photo of herself being visited by friends while she was in prison. The dance teacher alleged that her thyroid and diabetes medications were then removed. She added, I would have strange guards that were never in our unit, that I never saw before, walk in and ask other girls, hey. Where's that dance mom's lady? Where's that dance lady? I am going to get her. Then they come to your locker. They take a can of red soda pop, shake it up, open it and spray it all over your clothes. Hollywood Life has reached out to the Federal Bureau of Prisons about Abby's allegations. We have yet to receive a response. Although she's furious about the way she says she was treated, Abby is looking forward to returning to Lifetime with her show Dance Mom's Resurrection charting her return to the profession that she loves following prison and a serious health battle. Finally cancer-free after 10 rounds of chemo to treat non-Hodgkin lymphoma, Abby is celebrating life. On February 18 she shared a photo of herself, leaning back in her wheelchair, with her tongue out, while snow fell around her. She captioned the funny Instagram pic, catching snowflakes.